What do I do if my offer doesn't get accepted? Well, this is Nathan Barshinger with United Real Estate Central PA. In today's video, I'm going to cover what you should do if you put in an offer on a property and it doesn't get accepted. Now, before I get into it, please hit the subscribe button and tap the notification bell to be notified every time I upload a new video. Also, if you're looking to buy or sell real estate anywhere in the United States, just message me and I can introduce you to a great realtor that's in the business. So you've been searching for the perfect home for a few months now. You've seen many of them, but nothing looked as good as this one. It has an updated kitchen and bath. The layout was what you wanted, plus an in-ground pool. You told your agent that you wanted to put in an offer above asking price and even waive all the inspections. You thought for sure this property was going to be yours. The next day you get a call from your agent saying that the sellers accepted a different offer. Now you're discouraged and you don't know what to do. You spent all that time searching for the perfect home. You finally found it and then it was taken out from under you. Being content with where you're at right now is starting to look very good. However, your agent tells you not to give up, but all you can think about is he just wants that commission check that's coming for him at the end of it all. So of course he would say that. Now you're watching this video because you're trying to figure out what to do. The first thing I would suggest is to talk to your agent and create an action plan on how to get your next offer accepted. That might look like having a certain time set aside to look at a home that your realtor knows about. So as soon as you wanna see your next potential home, your realtor knows exactly what time to book a showing for you. You can also make an offer as early as possible set the response to date for that day or the next day. That way the seller doesn't have much of a chance to get in other offers and will accept yours if it is a strong offer and you don't waste time by waiting a few days to get a response. Second, if it took you this long to find the perfect home to put an offer on, you should rethink exactly what you're looking for in a home, write it down and figure out what certain things will cost such as updating a kitchen or putting in an in-ground pool, and then possibly start looking for homes in a lower price range so you have some extra funds available to do what you want with the home that you purchase. On the other hand, you could just check out new construction homes and have one custom built to exactly what you want if you can afford it. The third thing that you can do is if you're really discouraged and you don't wanna waste time looking at homes just to be disappointed because they looked a lot better in the pictures, is to fine tune your criteria so that every single thing that you're looking for in a home are already in the emails that you're getting from your realtor. You will receive a lot less homes that are on the market, but the ones that will be sent to you are exactly what you're looking for. If everything seems okay in the seller's disclosure and it looks really nice, don't hesitate to contact your realtor to book a showing. I mean, that's our job. <laughs> and if you like it, Bring your best offer because remember, this is exactly what you're looking for. Always remember, now is always the best time to buy real estate if you're playing the long game. It's better to buy real estate and wait than to wait to buy real estate. It always goes up over time. So there you have it, guys. I hope one of these strategies will work well for you. Make sure you consult with your realtor to get their input on what might be the best strategy for your situation. If you like this video, Please hit the like button and comment below any questions you may have or any suggestions for any other videos that I should do in the future. Again, this is Nathan Barshinger with United Real Estate. Thanks for watching. I hope you have a great week.